So today I'm going to demonstrate the correct procedure for administering a subcutaneous injection. So the subcutaneous tissue is the layer of fat that lies above the layer of muscle. So on these injection pads, this is the layer of fat, so the subcutaneous layer, and this layer below is the layer of muscle. So we want to inject our drug into this layer of fat. So the needle we use needs to be a short orange needle. So if the skin is visibly dirty, we'll clean the skin. And we'll clean the skin with a steret or an alcohol wipe. So we clean the skin for 30 seconds in a circular motion and then we let the skin dry for 30 seconds, which allows the alcohol to evaporate and take away all the bugs that are on the surface of the skin. But if the skin is visibly clean, then we don't need to prep the skin with the alcohol wipe. So, <clears throat> we're going to draw up our drug from a glass vial. And we're going to draw up our drug with the smallest needle that we've got available. So in this instance, it's an orange, a short orange 25 gauge needle. Now the rationale for drawing up with the smallest needle available from a glass vial is so that we minimise um, drawing up any glass particles. If we draw up with a large ball blunt needle, like so, don't know if you can see that. That's it, there we go. So we'll increase our chances of drawing up any small glass particles. But if we draw up With this needle, it's a tiny 25 gauge needle. So we've get, got less chance of drawing up glass and injecting it into our patient. So I'm just gonna prep the drug. Snap the top off with an ampule snapper. Pop that in the sharp spin. I've got my one mil syringe. I've got my needle that I've just opened. And I'm going to draw up my drug. So I've got my drug here. I've got a few air bubbles, so I'm going to expel those. I'm going to pull the plunger back, gently tap my syringe, and push the plunger up. At this point, I'm going to change my needle. I don't want to inject with this needle because I've just drawn up with it and it's not clean. So I'll discard this and pop it into a sharp spin and put my clean needle on. Okay, so I've got my drug in my syringe with my 25 gauge short orange needle. My skin is clean, or my patient's skin is clean. So I'm left-handed, so I'm going to inject with my left hand, and I'm going to use my non-dominant hand with my thumb and my index finger to pinch the skin. I'm just going to turn that pad around. So I'm pinching the skin 
in order to separate the subcutaneous layer from the layer of muscle to ensure that I actually do inject into the, the layer of fat. So I'll just take the end of my needle off. So I'm going to pinch the skin with my non-dominant hand and I'm going to hold the syringe like a dart and I'm going to inject the drug at a 90 degree angle. So I'm going straight down into the skin, all the way down, and I'm going to slowly inject my drug. Withdraw the needle and release my fingers. I put my drug with the needle straight into the sharp spin.